Hello, my name is Jennifer and welcome to part 11 of my Super Kids Challenge. And if you are returning, welcome back. And I, it's spooky day now. It's just a little bit longer or later than where I left off. Uh, let's see. Edward, I'm not sure what you were happy about getting done. Did you, you got your pictures done. Good. So now you need to play with some toys, which you do not have any in your inventory. So why don't we grab three just for now, and then we'll have you play with them. Play with the motion with all of them, and hopefully we'll get that done. And on to the next part of this. And I believe Colleen still needs to do, I think she might, might be my last one who needs to do things while inspired in terms of that. I think the rest are on to the next one. So he looks like he's going to, why don't we just come here and practice? And he is inspired. Oh, look, someone's playful. Oh, does that mean, oh, you're playful from playing with your toys. Oh, good. You know what you're going to do? <laughs> Now that you're playful, we're going to put you on your motor aspiration and we're going to have you come. It's it's 6.30 in the morning. <laughs> and by the time you get over here, it'll be later. You're going to go play pirate because we need you. Are you going to stay playful? Maybe not. But maybe you'll get playful when you're over here. I can only hope. <laughs> I can only hope. She's still really, really focused. But... She has to play with toys, but she's drawing. I think she did that autonomously because I was going to have someone else go there and draw. And then all of a sudden it didn't work and it turned out she was over there doing it. So what do you need? You're going to go play, but why don't we check your badges? Why don't we collect your social ability badge? And why don't you come resume that painting? <laughs> Since you're just sitting around doing nothing, you keep going to try and look after the garden, which I don't want to sell anything yet until you get your work chores coming in and so you got you got a promotion so you're gonna collect your civic responsibility badge which is like from cleaning the dishes and stuff like that he needs to take out the trash a few times but that's a little hard because the nanny keeps taking it out on <laughs> so that makes it a little harder so we're gonna view our badge progress and I know you want to do your homework but we can't do that yet well we can see whether you Okay, so you have more arts and craft, but that'll get done. You're actually not that far on your good deeds, so we should probably work on that so that we can get, um, and you never got your outdoor adventure done. Anyways, we can finish that here, but we can also, when we go to the park, we can do it then too. I can take a, open the fridge and take a look if there's anything that we don't really care about. So you're going to come and empty the trash. <laughs> this is my way of working on this. Just take stuff throw it in the trash and then <laughs> I could actually have him take a drink and uh, cancel it and then throw it out instead and that would be free as opposed to throwing our food away so he's coming here and I oh look we have dragon fruit we should probably put them inside now but I'm not going to do it till after I harvest because there is a little bit of a, a cheat I'll show you one just in case somehow it's not here so if we look actually I'll do this so if we look here We'll go on to Nora. If we look, it says harvest, and there's three of them. And if I take it and put it over where it can go, just anywhere, if you just move it anywhere, it, it gives you 10. <laughs> I didn't find, I found that out by mistake because I was trying to move things around, and I was like, oh, they changed it. You get 10. <laughs> And then I realized that the next day it was the normal amount. And then again, I had to move something because I was like trying to take stuff inside or outside or whatever. And I noticed it. So I realized that if you move a plant when it has stuff on it, it goes from the lower amount that you get with seasons um, or the gardening update, I should say. I don't think that's a seasons thing. I think that's a, the gardening update and puts it back to the 10 you used to get. So... So they got a little bit of extra money today. I probably should have done it with something that was cheaper instead of the dragon fruits. But I was uh, was sort of, I was going to move them inside. But anyways, I really should get them. We don't need, we actually have one, but I'll do it again later. We'll wait for her to get her call for work. Oh, she probably doesn't have to work today. Uh, Well, she does, but she probably doesn't because of her, because it's a holiday. 
and I probably made it a day off, not thinking that she was working, but she may as well wear a costume. So we're going to go under wear costume and she will wear a cheerleader one. There we go. So she's got the costume part done and maybe we'll come and do the presents early in the day. So we'll come and add some presents, add some presents. Are you needing to draw, my dear, or are you just drawing for the sake of it? You are just drawing for the sake of it because you're not even drawing anything that you need to draw. <laughs> You've got your first two pictures done. And, but we're not going to set you up to do anything right now. They're just doing things autonomously other than which child went to go play. And now he's inspired. He's all the way over here and he's inspired. That's a drag. <laughs> I was really wanting him to get that play while uh, playful. But he's two hours inspired and he is still playful from playing here, but not playful enough. So, while this is helping you with your motor skill, probably it's not really that useful. And this is actually when to play on a jungle gym while playful requires this or the spaceship for it to count. He's just not playful. That's why it's not counting. And I kind of thought that he wasn't going to be playful by the time he got over here. The uh, the monkey bars, which is what the aspiration shows, those are monkey bars and they count for the last part of it. I know I had recently seen someone uh, pose a question about whether, you know, why, why it wasn't working. And that was why, because this is what's considered to be a jungle gym, this or the spaceship. So he did get to level four, at least, while he was here. So he's going to go dig that up. And on your way back, why don't you come here and do a little play of these? Because this will help you with your um, fitness aspiration, as does dancing. And then when you get back, why don't, who needed to look for frogs? Who need, sorry, who, which two is the last two children? I think you still need your outdoor adventure badge. So why don't you come here and see whether we're going to look for, well, maybe we won't. Maybe we'll just look for, we're going to look for toys. We need more toys. So we're going to look for toys. Forget this looking for frogs. And we'll even look for, for, um, toys there. We will dig and we will look, look for more discarded toys there. And then we will come here and we will go fishing. A couple of times but I'll have to try and remember to pay attention to cancel that because he needs two more and that will get it he found a toy good not a void critter <laughs> void critter pack which is what I didn't really want so and you keep doing these pictures you don't need you need anyways I had stopped regardless so why don't we add some more presents why don't we come here and they're definitely gonna get their time and uh, rally the troops and we may as well check for spooky day gifts <laughs> the kids can't because they can't interact with the mailbox unless they've changed it I'm pretty sure they can't yeah they can just show they can they can show Bill's information which I don't think they could even click on a, a mailbox with the kids before that but okay so did you I need you to go check the mail <laughs> uh why don't we you're back there you're here so we're gonna get you to put on uh not that we want to wear a spooky costume we're gonna wear a, a sausage neither none of them are very good i have to say but we'll probably change them pretty quickly because they don't have very many options because it doesn't take into account the costumes that come with the packs there is a mod by scarlet that does um, so now I can't tell them apart <laughs> at all because they have that on. So she got 2,000 ounces of gold under the sea from Judith Soiree. So I want you to wear your costume. I guess the girls will wear those maybe. I don't know. And the boys will wear the Yodas. Not that I care. I just more that I'm trying to at least be able to tell them apart. Oh, no, I did it wrong. <laughs> oh, well, I guess she's wearing Yoda. I think she won't le wear it for very long. Maybe I'll... Hmm. I'd have to actually put little costumes on them if I wanted proper things that I would like. Okay, I need to switch to him. That's the problem. I'm on the wrong child. <laughs> wear a costume. You can wear a so sausage. Forget the boys and girls things. We're just going to wear costumes. 
wear a costume. You can wear a Yoda. And now you're playful. Now that you're not that far away, can you actually come back here and play pirate? And maybe you'll actually get it while you're playful. And okay, good thing I did forget. <laughs> not good thing I forgot, but good thing I was paying attention. I, well, I was came over to put his costume on and then realized that Oops, he needs to stop. We'll let you wear a Yoda. We'll let you wear a Yoda once you're done with this. And he has his scout badge. I don't remember. I don't know if he got his scout badge, but we're going to come home. And did you get that play? Is he may not even be there yet. So let's t check here. Collect a badge. He did not get his outdoor adventure badge. We'll worry about that later. So did you get your painting done? It's worth a good amount. Do we want you to sell it or do, did we ever buy a table? We did. And we have some paintings here. So we can maybe try and do a yard sale. I think we had no luck the last time. That was kind of why. And this we want to, it's locked. <laughs> Let's check all our doors. It's locked and we just have access and that's locked and there's Patchy and that. So she can actually come and sell everything because she is not working till tomorrow or we could harvest that that we want to harvest. So we might want to harvest the, not the avocados. I thought that was apple. Apple is over here. Harvest. And I think we have enough harvest. We have enough apples, don't we? Yeah, we're just gonna super sell. So we're gonna super sell, super sell, and come over here and super sell. And hopefully that gets pretty much everything. And we have scout meeting. So I guess we will have to do the present opening when they get back from their scout meeting. And I will probably have her do one more painting, do a landscape painting. But why don't I breed the frog? So she's going to like get that. They're just doing their thing. We'll get back to them when they get back from their scouts. But obviously she's making some money selling everything from the garden. So we can buy whatever we want. Well, not whatever we want. Within reason. They're definitely doing a little bit better than they were previously. So let's come and keep doing this. And maybe... For the fun of it, I'll give them each a party outfit that's a costume so that they can actually be in costumes, not these things instead. But let me come here and finish. So I'll do that when they get back from their scouts. So and she's painting and she sold pretty much everything. So we're good to go. So I'll be back unless something happens when they get back from their scouts. Well, I said I'd be back, but we got a phone call from... This girl, whose name I temporarily forget, and will donate the simoleon. I find it odd that the kids can get these calls. And he, our Freddy, did get this completed for... <laughs> wrong child. I guess it wasn't Freddy. Edward. One of them. Whoever it was that I sent over, because I can't recognize them anymore because they're in costumes. <laughs> got the... Here it is. It was Freddy. He got it finished, so now he's back. He needs to practice typing for four hours, which makes me realize I'm probably going to need some more computers. But now I'll be back when they get back, which they're running late, but hopefully they'll get there soon. Well, we got a pop-up from the scout meeting for Abigail. So we can either join in on the prank or we can give the scout leader some forewarning. I've seen them both go wrong. We will, we're going to join in on the prank. And the in this case, that worked out. The scout leader had a sense of humor. Now we have one for Declan. We're going to go. That's why gloves were invented because he's going to do some beach cleanup. And I don't see what the results are. We're going to keep the listed prices for Grant. Turn up the charm. Oh, and then we got another one. So Edward can either repair with dental floss or cross. We're going to try the dental floss. And that looks like that's it. So luckily... Luckily, they all seem to do well, and she did a masterpiece, even 1,859. So we'll stick this here for selling, and then we'll try and get her to do another one. There we go, another landscape. 
Hopefully she'll get started and maybe she probably won't get it done before they get back. We'll just end up canceling that. So now I'll be back when they get back unless something happens. Well, they're back and they're all in their little outfits that I gave them, which I think most of them all but uh, whoever I sent off to take a shower and I'll put them in it afterwards. But I did have them wear the costume first so that it counted and then they can put them in whatever I wanted them to be. So Spooky Spirit, actually, I need to buy a pumpkin carving table. And I will also need to buy a trick-or-treat bowl. So why don't I do some shopping? <laughs> the fun. Oh, here's this candle. It was 115. That was the present we got in the mail. And we did get one of these from her completing her, like, her joining the career. And she got that. So maybe what we'll do is we'll put the dragon fruit in here. And I'll probably buy, like I said, a couple of more. So that... I can so they take less space because I think these maybe take less space obviously it was more expensive to do it like this which is why I just planted it right into in the ground originally so I'm just gonna put this I'm just gonna put this stuff in our inventory and then I'm gonna buy a couple of more see whether we can have them right beside each other and yeah, we can't put it there I wonder, I might just leave obviously some planted there if this can go one notch over and if it still will count as being inside. I'll have to check when we're in live mode or I can probably check now. Sheltered, yeah, it is. And I just moved it now because it's already like it's, if I don't do it now, I'll probably forget that summer. So you wanna keep it here and I might move the garbage out from where it is because I'm not really doing any dumpster diving. There we go. And we can, we'll just put this here for now because I know I can move that out because it's a winter one. And the blackberry, the parsley, we have room there. And then maybe we'll buy one more of these. I can fit it there. I'll have to see how well this works. I'm not used to actually putting them so close to each other like that. And then this is winter, so we'll put it outside also, if I remember. And I should probably do the same thing. Well, I can't really. Well, if it's there. <laughs> um, and I should do that. If I can, it does fit there. So these are summer and fall. They're in season, but we'll just move them right away because we know they're going to be not working there anymore and that's well that's kind of a useless <laughs> that was my failed splice plant fall and winter fall and winter fall and spring but we are fine without carrots anyways well we're we're not done because <laughs> I need to do what I originally set out to do when we came in here which was move this over and then buy some pumpkin carving stations here they are and they're 375 so we'll buy a few because they all need to do it and we could always sell it we'll just buy three that's good enough and then we need to buy a little do we have a little table anywhere anywhere in the house not that I can see so we're gonna go into surfaces and we'll buy something inexpensive to go out here I'm thinking that's cheap and we'll see whether we can put the bowl on it here it is sugar and spice candy bowl and it does fit on top so we're set for that and let's see now that we have done that so if you look here, it says right on there, you can interact with ghosts, vampires, or aliens. You can also carve pumpkins or play spooky music on the pipe organ, which we, of course, do not have. But we could do this. So we're going to add a present, and then we're going to try opening presents with everyone. Not the nanny. That didn't work <laughs> the last time we tried it. I don't know how well it worked, period. So let's try and get this spooky day. A few more things done for spooky day. There are a lot more options for you know, teens and up, but I decided I would give Nora an outfit and have her change too, so that she's in one of the similar 
s- outfit to the others. And I, whoever just had a shower, I need to probably change him. Was it Edward? Well, we'll we'll dress. I can't remember who it was. Well, Ed- they all look like they're. I, mean, I can't see them all. A lot of them are here, and they're in their costumes. So they're not all here. Oh, she's not in her costume. Well, we'll worry about the costumes after we open the presents. I don't even remember doing the decorations, but it counted anyways. <laughs> so we were good on that. Okay, so she's got her presents, and she got some upgrade parts. <laughs> good thing you like that, Nora. I think some people might not. <laughs> Are you opening your present? You're there. It shows it in your queue, but everybody leaving. Oh, there you are. What did you get? I hope you got something good. Well, it's shiny, sparkly. You got a TV, <laughs> which we already have one of those TVs. Now, how about you? Oh, you are coming and you're even next. Probably that's the order I chose because you came up alphabetically. Sparkly again. She got a violin of her own. No sharing for you. Or maybe. <laughs> we'll see. What did you get? I don't... It didn't tell me. You got a humor and hijinks festival bubble bottle. Well, I'm glad you like that. <laughs> I've seen better. <laughs> now it's Declan's turn. Hopefully. You got something that you like. That's the most important thing. Oh, you got a Boo Boo Billy Doctor playset, which is good for empathy and uh, mental skill. Are you coming, Edward? You are, so you should be next. Oh, there he is. Oh, he got a uh, Blarfy. And now, Freddy, it's your turn. It is queued up. I think sometimes it's quicker just to tell them to do it individually. <laughs> But, oh well, at least they're coming. That's the main thing. And it looked like that was good. You got a train set, cargo car, and now Grant. And you are coming. Oh, well, I don't know why you thumbs downed it. Well, I can kind of tell. It's actually not anything you can play with. It's just a decoration. It's not really that useful. And you got one of those too. Another. So we're going to add some presents to like boost up this present pile. And maybe that's why it didn't work the other day, because I had asked her, like, second, and then she never came, and then no one else came afterwards. So that might be why it's not so good. I thought I had done it with service people before, and it had been fine. But they've opened their presents. They still need to do some pumpkin carving, so I'll probably, you know, you can carve, uh, we'll get them, get the first three started. She can do better. She can do more. She has more choices. <laughs> she can do better, but she can has more. Oh, and she has the same choices. So there we go. So their three are set up. But I think we will finish Spooky Day in the next part. And I see a broken shower that Nora has to fix. That's going to be it for this part. Thanks very much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye. This has been Jennifer. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them below. I'd love to see them. If you liked the video, please leave a like. And if you'd like to see more videos of challenge, let's plays, tutorials, and occasional speed builds, please subscribe if you haven't already done so. Thanks very much.